So here's the uh, valve timing and the as-built uh, supercharged two-stroke pop-up valve. So this is in the three and a half horse engine block. So starts out on power stroke, and the right there is when the exhaust valve starts to open. See, so I put a line on the cylinder wall there. That's about one inch down out of a one and three-quarter stroke. And then right there, the inlet valve starting to open. And then we're at bottom dead center there. And then comes up a little bit. And the exhaust valve closed. Inlet valve still open. Then the inlet valve closes there. So if you can see that mark there, the exhaust valve um, opens sooner than the inlet valve closes. If you know what I mean. So uh, then it comes up compression and power stroke. I believe this timing is something similar to what the Rolls-Royce Creasy had, but maybe not quite as radical as that. But anyway, that's the two-stroke block there. And then once again I've got this uh, fin in the combustion chamber there to separate the uh, inlet and exhaust valves. So basically what takes place, the exhaust goes out the valve, then at this point when both valves are open, the inlet comes in from the supercharger and it can't come directly into the exhaust valve, so it'll get shot out into the cylinder this way, hopefully swirl around. And so the object here is to clean the exhaust out of the cylinder, so it will be coming up headed for the exhaust valve due to momentum. And then at the same time as the inlet charge gets shot in, swirls around, so the object here is to not have a lot of the inlet charge go out the exhaust valve but instead to clean out the cylinder. And uh, since I have really no guarantees that that's what's going to take place, that's uh, the one reason why I have some doubts as to how well this engine will run. Uh, I expect it will run, but you never know how well. And uh, uh, anyway, uh, that's why I have some questions about it.